What is up guys and girls, it is me NKO here, and in today's uh, video we're doing some uh, Monster Hunter World. I think it's episode 11 now, I think we're getting, we're getting quite far in the series. A lot farther than um, I was honestly anticipating. I was kind of, I was, wasn't really expecting it to take off as much as it has, and I'm really happy that it has so far. It is 4th of July today, so happy 4th of July. I know it's going to be coming out for July 5th, is this when this video is going to be coming out, but I thought I'd say it anyways, just because I didn't say it in yesterday's video, or today's video. It's really confusing. Um... Now, we're in today's video, we're going to continue the campaign. Let me... I think we got to fly over to the other part of the map, don't we? Yeah, we got to go research base. Let's go talk to uh, Longtoes and see what she wants. Now, I'm hoping that we wrap up this series right around when um, Iceborne is coming out. Or the Winter DLC is coming out. Or I think it's Iceborne, yeah. When Iceborne comes out, but that's my that's my goal is to pick up with Iceborne there, and then we have a Shadow Keep for Destiny, and then um, Borderlands Three. I'm pretty sure it comes out then. What, what does this person want? A Tail Rider Safari. Okay, that's nice. Not sure what that is. I kind of don't understand that, but it's cool. It's new, and it's Tail Riders. Alrighty, long tail lady, what you want, fam? Oh, we're still part of the Rotten Vale? Okay. Um, not sure what that just was there. I think that was like a... Like setting up the lobby, maybe? I'm not exactly sure. I've never actually seen that type of menu before in-game. Um, I think we're fighting out Garen now, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I think I think it is. Because I think we come down here and our handler does something stupid. Well, then again, most of the things she does are stupid things, but I'm pretty sure that's what we're doing here. This is the longest Monster World loading screen I've ever been in. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. What is it loading? Okay, I give up. I'm just... <laughs> oh, there we go, okay. <laughs> Alright, into the bowels of the veil. 50 minutes. We can't fire an SOS flare yet, so we have a cutscene, which means we're gonna find a new monster here. I'm gonna eat, because... I know exactly what's about to happen, I'm pretty sure. Um, I think we're good with weaponry. Pretty sure we are. A stereo jerky's always fun. Alrighty, so I think we're supposed to walk around, and then while we're doing that... Our handler will get shebanked, if that makes any sense. Alright, we're, so we're finding stuff like this, okay. Why the hell did she make such a loud noise? Jesus Christ. <laughs> um, I think it's up he here more. Oh, this is all effluvia, though. Start losing health in this, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, see. Yeah, let's avoid this then if we don't have to, to come over here. I don't want it to lose health if we don't have to, if that makes any sense. Um, Honey, hello. Anything... I don't remember where these tracks were. I know we're supposed to just walk around and look for it, but I don't know if there's any specific spots to look for it. I am going to grab bones and stuff while we're doing this and just hang out a little bit. Materials are always nice for building stuff. I think the Odegarin stuff's actually pretty good, so we'll probably end up going for that. I may grind for that off screen, just because its perks are pretty nice to have early game. Late game is crap, obviously, but late game builds change very often, so it's not surprising to me. Any other bones in here? Nope. All right, we're good. Well, that's it. That was a gain. Um, I guess let's just go around this way and just look around. Oh, isn't this where the really rare fish spawns? Question mark? Smiley face? I know that little puff puff thing spawns here. Yeah, 
the water down here is pretty awesome. Let me see if I can catch some fish for our fish tank back at base. Oh, we got two of them, sweet. Oh, I got a bat. Hey, look at that, guys. Oh, there it is, okay. I am not going to mess with that right now, because I'm pretty sure there's a big fish that can spawn around here. It's been a long time. Me and Legacy used to come around here and actually farm for this fish to find it, try to find it. So if it spawns here, we're going for it. I don't think it's here, though. This doesn't seem like the right area. Yeah, no, I don't think this is the right area. All right, whatever. Let's go over here and get this going. What's going on here, Chief? How is that not? Why are you touching that, dude? It's hot as hell. I know we've reached the bottom. But what happened to Zora Magic? There's no place else for it to go. Dude's teleported, dude. It's like Alakazam in early Pokemon games. <laughs> that was the most, that was the biggest one. Look at that. Dumb decision number twenty-five. so cool he looks so cool but he looks like cool like a like in a resident evil kind of cool not like a i'd have you as a pet kind of cool bro i was supposed to instigate the fight not you what are you doing oh my lord i'm gonna die no way in hell. <laughs> that Vigor Wasp was 0.10 seconds too late, dude. Jesus. <laughs> Didn't I already use an SOS Flare? Yeah. Alright. Let's try this again, I suppose. I doubt anybody can actually join. <laughs> do we have an Agent Potion? We do. I hate using that so early on, but I don't want to risk losing this quest just because of that stupid crap, you know? What bothers me is the fact that that cat did not want to detonate that little healer ball on me. That wasn't very cash money at all. Alrighty. Getting a little too reckless here if I'm thinking. Chief, please. Chief, Chief, listen, listen. Cortana is not here. Chill out, Brev. I want to keep him from enraging, if at all possible, too. That's the general goal here. Oh, my lord. I don't even know how... Okay. <laughs> I was about to say, I have no idea how I'm dodging these attacks. He's also one of those monsters you don't want to lose eye contact with. Yeah. What now? What now? What now, jerk? Well, the timing could have been a little better with that. There's one more over here. Come here. Come here, doggy. with that. Like, I need to stop relying on that so much. Please don't notice me. Don't notice me, Senpai. Senpai, no! Oh my god, the game is flipping and I have no idea what to do with itself at this point.
Now we are gonna trap this guy because, like I said, I need to get his materials. Oh, you're out of you're out of stamina, bub. You're out of stamina, bud. What's your grand plan now, brother? I absolutely cannot use my sword soul like this. Oh, I have demon drugs? Oh my god, I need to mine my inventory more often. Alright, that's actually perfect. I needed him to leave because I need to start my sword super bad or else I'm going to waste that entire thing on him. Alright, when he starts to limp, we're definitely going to go for that trap because I definitely want to trap him. That would be really clutch, if that makes any sense. Alright, now up here, we have two issues. Obviously him, him, him being one of them. The obvious other one is the fact that there's a Fluvia, so we're gonna get we're gonna get kind of banked a little bit here. He's gotta be so weak by now, Jesus. He's really determined on having this being his final boss area. Oh, he just got bleeded. Oh no. Try to take aggro. That's a limp. That's a definite limp right there, Chief. Chase him. Chase him chase him down. Does he already have his nest? Oh my god, if, he's at his, if this is where his nest is, that would be so nice. Oh, he's down. He's way down there. He got. He's all the way down to his nest. That's going to be such a pain to get over there. Pain of shabooty. Shachiki. Shabonka. Shabonka donka. Kronka. Kronkus. Junkus. Hopefully this guy doesn't kill him. If he gets there before me, I, I'm pretty sure I'm taking the right way. Down to his nest. I think it's all the way down at the bottom there. I'm putting the ghillie on just so I don't have to worry about things attacking me while I'm trying to get down there. I'm keeping an eye on his HP too, because I don't want this guy to get there before me. I actually want to trap this thing. It'd be really clutch to trap it. I know I keep saying it, but it'd be really clutch. <laughs> He should already have the um, sleeping po uh, sleeping poison gases on him already getting at him, so I don't think I have to worry about that, but the trap is a big deal. Nice, we got it. Whew, that was awesome. That was a fun fight. Aside from dying that first time, that was actually pretty fun. It happens every once in a while. We got the tail though. That is pretty nice. The Bushman. Bush is a man. I am Bushman. Man of Bush. Half Bush, half man. Alrighty. Good work with your field reports of the Coral Islands and the Rotten Vale. Okay. Hmm. Alright, I don't want to see what this guy's talking about. He's spoiling the rest of the game. Freaking jerk. See that? He just spoiled it for me. We're gonna leave that for the next time. Or that for the next part. Excuse me. That'll be on Tuesday's video. We need the part of the expedition to go see the Wyberian clues. Um but first let's let's upgrade our some let's let's check out what gear we can make now, because this is what I really wanted to look at, because I know the armor for Ordigaro is pretty cool on female characters. Let's see how it is on male characters. Oh that is fucking awesome. Excuse my French. We need this in our life. Alright, I'm gonna do some off screen farming of this gear for us. We're gonna get some straight woke gear going out of this. Now, this was something I was interested in well, it was the Hornetari gear. That was because I had a fluvial expert on it, though. I don't know. 
So we have to look at too. All right, let's look at our Palico's gear. What can we get? Oh, wow, we have a lot of stuff we haven't seen in a while. So what, what, what do we got? All right, that's like a little little Bowser. I like it. What we got here? All right, little princess. He's a man. We can't have him in that. Uh, looks actually kind of cool. Reminds me of Chopper from One Piece a little bit. The diva outfit. Right, Legiana. Oh, Legiana, he looks freaking woke in that. Oh, to Garen? Nah, not, not as cool. Not as, definitely not as cool as the main armor. The main question is, there was an armor set that gave a, they gave, did specific type of damage I was interested in. Maybe it's Raytheon? One of them had paralysis, I'm pretty sure, didn't it? I don't think we've gone to it, maybe. I don't know. I think we may have to do our boy with this. Get him in this gear. Feline Bond Ball would be a bad idea. I think Poison would be better. Give him some Poison stuff and make it get him in there. Make him a Vanguard unit. Put it on him. Like this boy look freaking cool. I like the little glowing paw print in the center. If that's what that's supposed to be, I'm not sure. I think it looks cool though. Alrighty. Let's look at our guy. Where is he? Oh. Look at you, dude. Look cool. Let me get a better angle. Look at this guy. Wiping it off like you don't just don't care. Look at this. Straight. Cool dude. Well, alrighty guys and girls, we are going to end it here for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. Um, had a lot of fun killing Odegarin, getting my ass whooped by Odegarin as well. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching once again. If you guys enjoyed this video, drop a uh, like and a comment down below. If you have any uh, hunts you want me to do on my other character, for instance, comment that down below and I'll get on to it as soon as possible. And then, um, subscribe for future content. That's always appreciated as well. Um... But yeah, thank you guys for watching once again, and I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Later.